Hello, my name is Caitlin with West Palm Dog, and today I'm here with Aria, and we're going to be working on her sit. Now, sit is a command that a lot of dogs learn accidentally. They figure out that if they sit in front of you, they can get food, attention, anything else that they might need. But it's still important that we're able to cue the command on our terms. So what I'm going to do, hey! I got some food. I'm just going to toss it to get her ready. Aria! Yes, and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna treat multiple times to imply a stay. What this does is it prevents something called dining and dashing. Tap on the head, okay. That tap on the head just releases Aria from the, from the behavior. It tells her that she's free to go. Now we're gonna do that again. Hey. Aria sit, yes. And you see the second her rump hits the ground, I'm saying yes to mark that behavior and then treating her. Tap on the head, okay. And do that one more time, she's doing really good. Aria, sit, yes. Gonna treat one more time, tap on the head, okay. And that was a really great job from Aria. You can see she did a really great job of holding that sit. She didn't break at all. As you can see, she was sliding a little bit, but she was still holding that sit really nicely. Now, if Arya had gotten up during any of the times I was treating, that's called breaking. What I would do is I would just put her back into a sit and wait a couple seconds for treating her. We don't want to encourage any breaking. And by waiting that couple extra seconds, we're telling Arya that if she breaks, she's gonna have to wait longer for the food. But overall, really nice job from Arya today. She did awesome. Good job. Good job.